Hello everyone. For those of you who don't already know, my name is Mr Moore and I'm Head of Art here at Hinkley Academy in John Cleveland Sixth Form Centre. Um, for those of you who've just seen my art uh, video, I do apologise, but some of what I'm going to say now is going to be repeated. The reason for repeating myself is because GCSE Art and GCSE Photography are almost identical courses. The way they're laid out, the way they're assessed um, is identical. So let me just um, explain some of that to you now. So in photography, over the two years, just like in art, you'll be expected to create a portfolio of work. This portfolio of work um, is um, built up over the two years and is worth 60% of your final grade. So a massive chunk of your final grade comes from all the sketchbook work that you do, developing ideas that respond to sort of like a theme within, um, within your coursework. Uh, the other 40% comes from an exam. Now this is externally set, so the exam board sent a list of themes to you and you choose one of those and work on it in your sketchbooks uh, for extended period of time. At the end of that you get given a 10 hour exam. Now that sounds quite scary, but it isn't at all. Um, in that 10 hour exam, over two days, you'll be sort of in a room as a photography student developing a final piece that sort of sits in or sort of works alongside uh, um, your sketchbook work that you've been doing for the exam. The best way to um, really sort of sample or see what it's like to be a GCSE photography student is to uh, see examples of what previous students have done. So um, have a look on YouTube and you'll find loads of examples of GCSE photog photography students who have um, recorded like a journey through their project, uh, f flicking through the different pages, and you can see the sort of work and the level of um, detail that, that's needed in, in those sorts of projects. So definitely, if you're considering this as an option, have a look at that. Talk about talk about it with your parents. If you've got any questions to ask, my email address is posted in this PowerPoint, so you can always um, send an email to me asking me any sorts of questions about the course, and I'll try and get back to you as soon as possible. As you have done in year nine, um, as part of the GCSE photography course, you'll be developing your ability to edit and manipulate different images, uh, use different sort of lighting techniques to get the most out of the pictures that you want, learning a lot more about composition and how to, um, how to arrange a picture. But as well as that, we've got to really think about the transferable skills that you're learning on a course like this. Um, so your ability to be a creative thinker and problem solve and think outside the box, um, your ability to work on extended project is a, is a massive key skill that um, I'm sure any future employer would um, be happy for you to sort of possess. Thanks guys, I hope to see you in my classroom in September.